Italy. Buongiorno, everyone, and welcome to the Pensley Performing Arts Amphitheater. Um, are you sure we're in the amphitheater? Inside. Yes. <laughs> I don't think this is the amphitheater, but let's run with it anyway. Run with it! So, who are, why are we here tonight? Uh, we are here because Iverdi Confuzi is being extremely nice to open for Il Totolo Provisorio's kind of mostly premiere performance. Il Totolo Provisorio is the graduate troupe for Youth Comedia, which their show is tomorrow at five, from 5 to 6 in the PA tent. Shameless Woo! advertisement. Um, yeah, so you guys are here to see Comedia. I, at least I hope that's why you're here. Otherwise, you were in the wrong area. <laughs> I'm here for cheese. I love show. cheese! I'll stop. I think I got on the wrong bus. Well, <laughs> we are here to celebrate the first three-act performance of a brand new troupe. That is... Il Totolo Provisorio. Don't no, worry. No one can pronounce it, but Shauna and I. Half of them can pronounce it. And I, I, but first, before we get to their three act, Iverde Confuzi wishes to give you one of our favorite plays. It is a short one act play, and I will just briefly tell you the history that we, we first created this at our third Iron Comedia. And many of you are familiar with Iron Comedia here at Hensley. Iverde Confuzi started doing Iron Comedia in 2009, and this one came, um, this was probably our most successful one, and we've loved the play ever since. Uh, in three hours and five minutes, the play was, from the first concept to the final bows, the play was, was written, cast, rehearsed, and performed. And it's a fun little piece. And it's a good, it's a good warm up, and it gives Il Totolo some time, Il Totolo, some time to prepare, because I'm sure none of you are in our play. It's not like three fifths of the five person cast for our show are in your play or anything like that. No, 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 not like no, that not at all. all. No, no, nope, not at all. Nope. But that means that we'll be seeing a lot of, a lot of your troop tonight. So as, as we hear the rain coming down, and are happy we switched to the, our rain site. With uh, with much ado and hopefully all being caught in the really close video camera, we now I'll work on it. <laughs> we now present for you buckets of ducats. Someone is manly and, and, and skilled and, and courtship could, could maybe teach me some things. I think that is a wonderful idea. I love to teach people how to how to do and what Capitano does. I am like putting in your hands. No. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So we must begin with the correct 
stance of a, of a manly man. So not like that. First, you must take a strong, strong stance. Wider, stronger. Perfect. Then you must stand like a man. Push your chest up. Squeeze your butt forward. Lift that your head high. Uncomfortable. And put your hands on your hips. You own it. Wait, no, no, ah. hold. Push it. And then you need to walk like a big strong man. Walk? Walk just like that. The How big striding steps. <laughs> Do you feel it? Do you feel the big, big, strong man? I'm definitely feeling something. <laughs> perfect, that is perfect, perfect, perfect. So, so. <sighs> you all right there, Flavio? Can't I handle am, the big man I'm now? ready to be a big man now. Okay, 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 okay. Now that you know how to stand like a big man and walk like a big man, I would teach you another trick, but I don't think I have the space for it. <laughs> so, I think now you are prepared to woo your woman that you have been looking for. Okay, so now I can stand like a big man and walk up to her like a big man. I feel I am now ready to woo my true love, Flaminia. Wait, what? Oh yes. no, that's the woman I am meant to marry with my she, 512 buckets. What am I going to do? Wait! Flavio, Flavio, um, you know, I think my teachings are not, not quite finished yet. You know, not? women are also like intelligent men, men who can think for themselves, which is the opposite of you. So, let us, let's, let's do something that, that requires thought. You know, like, um, uh, gambling. Let's, let's, let me teach you how to gamble. Keep you occupied for a few hours. Does counting five mean a good thing? I can count to five. Perfect. Follow me. Okay. Did I just see what I thought I saw? Because I obviously wasn't listening, because whoever would listen to those idiots, I mean, can't be talking on Flavio. But what I saw was that Flavio was going off with Capitano. But why would Flavio ever want to go off with Capitano? <gasps> the only explanation is... Flavio is being kidnapped! What a horrible crime! What a disastrous plot! What a brilliant idea! I wish I'd thought of it, but maybe I could have thought of it. Maybe I could think of it first. Because they're just now starting the kidnapping. Which means if I send a ransom note, I can get the money. And I don't even have to worry about actually doing any of the work. Ah! This is the best idea I've ever had. Oh, Bergella, you're a genius. Let's see. So, hmm. We're going to send this to Flavio's family. We're going to ask for, okay, kidnap Flavio. Uh, 500, 512 ducats. Ever want to see again? Broken bones, cuts, blood, deep, dark pit, pit. Sent to Barcelona. Ugh. All right, <clears throat> now, I just need some idiot to deliver this letter. Arlequino! Arlequino! It's so hard to find good idiots these days. Arlequino! Oh, oh, oh. Hi, Brigella. No touching. Oh, right, right. You know I, I remember you, you told me about that. All right, Arlequino. My good friend, Brigella. He's, he's my very close and personal friend, Brigella. He tells me that every time I see him. All the time. No touching. Oh, right. I touch, not you. Air, air touching? Air, is air touching okay? That's still touching. Okay. okay. But, but, Arlequino, you. Me? You are perfect I am? for this task. Oh, really? Yes, because if anyone finds out you're doing it, they won't know I. 
Oh, okay. That that makes sense. What I need you to do probably to you is take this letter. Oh, a letter. This letter. Okay. This letter. Yes. Right here. This letter. Right here. Oh. This letter right here. Yes. This letter. This letter. That letter. This letter. Take it to Flavio's family. Flavio's father. Flavio's who, who, whoever. Just make sure someone in Flavio's family gets it and reads it. Flavio's father. Flavio's family. Fla right. Flavio. Flavio. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I yeah. forgot. You want them to know it's me. Ah. <clears throat> Signed sincerely, Capitano Testosterone. Moo ha 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 ha. They'll think he's a real villain. Now, take it to Flavio's family. Fla Flavio. Right. Got Flavio. you. I can't wait to get those 512 tickets. <clears throat> Flavio. 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 <laughs> I got a frog in my throat. Sorry. I, who, who was I supposed to take it? Flav, 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 Flaminius family. Flam, Flaminius family. Right. This I heard my name. Oh, Flaminia. Oh, it's supposed to be for you. Oh, thank you. This must be for my beloved Flavio. I'm sure that's exactly what it is. This is terrible! Oh, mistress, mistress, what, what could possibly be the matter with you? Flavio's been kidnapped! And the ransom is 500... 512 ducats? He doesn't even pay me, so why would he pay a ransom? Uh, uh, well, it's okay. I mean, he's not the only rich man in the entire city. We could probably go and ask someone for a loan of some sort. I, I have an idea. Oh, no. This will never end good. I'll just marry a rich man, and he'll pay the ransom to release my beloved Flavio. Uh, don't, you see a, don't you see a little problem with that plan? Like at all? No. Not even a, a till you till you die? To death do us part problem? <laughs> no. It'll work, you'll see. Ah, uh, mistress, I don't think this is a good idea. I wonder what that was all about. Oh. Uh, you know? Oh. Did you deliver the letter? The the letter I, I gave the letter. I, I Okay, good, like you gave said. the letter. Yes, what happened letter, next? Just like you said. Well, well, Minio wants to marry a rich man? Whoa, that's news! Flaminia wants to marry a rich man? Mm-hmm. And I'm about to become a rich man! So I could marry Flaminia, I, I could use the 512 ducats to be a dowry. And then I have access to Flaminia's household, which means I'd have access to her father Pantalone's money. This is even better than I thought. So once Flavio's family pays me the ransom, I can pay Flaminia's family, and then marry Flaminia, and then have access to all that money. This day is getting even better and better. This is the best day of Brigella's life. You know, I think I'm going to celebrate. And I think I know where there's some tarts I can steal. <laughs> uh, that Capitano, he's such a great teacher. I mean, he was, he was teaching me gambling, and he wanted to demonstrate how to lose, so he kept losing. Uh, he, he was acting like he was losing, I'm sure, because I'm sure he was really good at gambling. He even acted to, like he was crying, too. I mean, this is great. I've got, I've got his hat and his doublet and his sword. I even got this, this chest of 500 and... Is it 500? 512 ducats. Yes. Oh, 512 ducats? 
Why, yes, yes, I do. Flaminia needs 512 ducats. To Flaminia needs 512 yes. ducats? To oh. free her beloved from a kidnapping plot. To free her be beloved? Uh huh. But I thought, it, I thought that I was her beloved. Why couldn't I have been kidnapped? No, I was love you. I look, you know, I need you to do something for me. Oh, what do you need me to do, Flavio? Take this trunk of 512 ducats. <gasps> Take it to Flaminia's family so that she and her beloved can live happily ever after. Happily ever after. Got it. Me. I think I may have strained my spleen. <laughs> Mistress, so, I've heard that Brigella is becoming really, really rich, so I can just marry him and he'll pay Flavia's ransom. Mistress, that's the, truly the worst idea I've ever heard in the entire world. Oh, the Kino, you have a chest. I wonder what's in it. 512 ducats! This is perfect, mistress. We can just use this money to pay off the ransom. You don't have to marry Brigella or anyone besides Flavio, you know, the one you actually love. Okay. Arlecchino, take this to the ransomer and pay him off. Yeah. Oh, Let's go play my wedding. Yes. I heard not one, but two people have paid the 512 ducat ransom. I can definitely pay the dowry, have enough for myself, and get all the pantalones money. And marry, uh, marry Flaminia. She's, she's pretty good looking. This is, this is a perfect day. Arlecchino, is that the ransom? Yeah, this, this, is, this is the chest. This All right, let's, let's see. Oh, yeah, definitely 512 ducats. Oh. He's good. Best day ever. Arlecchino. Uh oh. Here. No, I don't. Take this to Flaminia's family. It's, the, it's, it's my bride price. All right. So I can marry Flaminia. Okay. Meanwhile, sure. I'm going to get some more of those charts. I love blueberry. Oh so, I think the green and purple color scheme will be perfect for my wedding. <laughs> uh, Flaminia, I'd really rethink that, that whole color combination. It's, it, it screams giant dinosaur. <laughs> Arlecchino, why are you giving us this again? Yeah, that looks like the chest we just gave you. Yeah. No, it's, 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 they're, they're, they're ransomer. I, what? We want you to give it to the ransomer. Yeah, you're just, you're confused, no, Arlecchino. I gave it to Brigella. No, sweetie, you need to take it to the kidnapper, Capitano. Wait a minute. We should go to side of the Oh, yes, I think um, definitely they're a terrible idea. I am so good. Pretty nice doublet. Hat fits. This sword. Yeah. How the heck does he put it in his belt? The length of my leg? Ah, Capitano, Moco Blanco, Coffee, something. <laughs> Tall. He's the guy. He's the guy I gotta give this to. Please, please. Shut up and take my money! <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, this looks very familiar. It's another trunk. It looks like the one Capitano gave me. Come on. Another five hundred and twelve. Five hundred and twelve ducats. He can do it too? <laughs> This is great. Capitano is so generous. He wanted to make me really feel better about myself, so he, he gave me another chest. Wait, 
with this 512 ducats, I could talk to Flaminia's father. Maybe with, with this I could maybe get him to look at me as a suitor. This could be bride price. Arlequina. Oh no, not again. I need you to take this to Flaminia's father. I don't understand what's going on here. Everybody, please come and help me. Why does everybody keep giving me enormous piles of cash? Screaming! What's wrong? And Arlequino, is that the second ransom payment? I, I mean, uh, I know nothing about a ransom. Wait, wait, I have a, I have the ransom note right here. Um, Brigella, do you happen to know anyone who would sign a ransom note? Mwahaha. Oh, oh yeah, I know many people who, I mean, no, <clears throat> no, no, no one, nope. No one comes to mind? Nope. No one comes to mind, especially not individuals who like to wear green and names start with B. Definitely not them. You know what? I think that you're the kidnapper, and I think we need to figure out what's going on here. Oh, 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 oh. I'm the kidnapper. What proof do you have? A letter signed by, look, right here. It says, like I know somehow, it says Capitano. Capitano is the kidnapper. And, as we see, Flavio isn't here. Flavio is kidnapped. So, obviously, Capitano right here is the kidnapper. Because he's here, and Flavio's... Flavio! Flaminia. <laughs> Interesting. Um, well, as we see, Flavio is obviously not kidnapped, so there was obviously no crime committed. And Fregella has done nothing wrong today. <laughs> you! Uh -oh. You're the man that stole my tarts! Um, only the blueberry ones? No, actually, you took most of the greenberry ones, which I'm now pretty sure they were the ones that were spoiled. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> Why are you? Excellent! Get him! Flavio! Flaminia! I'm... Almost positive we can get married now, and we should go do that before something else happens. <laughs> I've got the 512 ducats. I've got the confidence. I'm falling now. <laughs> but let's get out of here before I fall the rest of the way. Wait, how, you? how do you know what gravity is? I didn't know you ever actually went to school. <laughs> <laughs>
Buckets of Ducats, the first of the entertainment tonight. And as you can see in the programs, we have forgotten to pass out, which we should probably Wait, go through. Nope. Yeah, it's about to do. Yep. Yay. Maybe she has our program. Those are tarts. Um, you can see, They're very the tarts. You can see own. in the programs that uh, we have some so limited information. It, it it's for both of our shows, numbers. but it tells you a little bit who, uh, who actually helped write the original draft. And I'd also like to say special thanks to Hannah, who is not in the program, but agreed to be our tart seller today. Do you have some of the tart programs? Because she only has the other ones. Oh. James? Yes. <laughs> oh. Wait, I thought you had to be... Do you have your guys' programs? No, you. That also didn't get passed out? There is also one other discrepancy in our programs due to somebody getting sick. Um... Grania is totally Niccolo Bartolazzi. Just don't question it. Totally. Okay. Same person. Obviously. Wait, 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 wait. No, come here, come here, come here. They're, they're twins. It's like we're long lost twins. I'm looking in the mirror. This tells you I'm, I'm looking in the mirror. I'm trying to see. You want to give me a hand? You are in the That is so good. Which, here you go. Sorry, it's right. Okay. Here it is. Well, I'm sure it's pretty nice. There you go. Um, so, given the fact that we are sharing some costumes, the next play will probably start in a moment, but I'll let them do it on Jordan whenever. We just need one. Oh, you know your size. That's like a working title. We're standing over. No, I was walking over here. Oh, oh that's hurting. Okay. Oh, that's hurting. Oh, that's hurting. Oh, that's hurting. Oh, that's hurting. Oh, 
Capitano! Oh, Victoria, my dear. I'm so glad I found you. We really need to figure out this whole this whole wedding thing that we're doing. There's so much to plan. There's there's the decorations and the flowers and the food and the musicians. Oh, it's a nightmare. Just I love good. it. Just good. But first, we have to figure out the seating arrangements. I can't have any drama at my wedding that isn't my own. So it's very important that we figure this out. And we must start with the head table because we are the most important. Well, I am anyway. So I'm thinking that my sister, Isabella, should be seated on my left. What about you? Well, I do have an old army buddy, Orazio. He is a friend of mine from way back to the only friend I have. You have a friend? Oh, congratulations, sweetheart. Aww. Aww. Yeah. 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 Spectacular. There's nothing that could go wrong with this meeting. Yeah. We'll have them meet later on today as to avoid all of the drama. Excellent. I'm so excited. Yes, dear. <laughs> Oh, Isabella, I'm so happy I found you! I'm so upset you had to find me so soon, considering I was supposed to be leaving Nice this morning. Why were you leaving Nice? Why are you even here in the first place? I had business. Ooh, and by, and by business, do you mean a man? <gasps> you do! This is fantastic news! Who is he? Where can I find him? Is he, like, big and tall and muscular? Didn't you have something more important to talk to me about? Oh, yes, I did. Um, so, my lovely, lovely, cowardly fiancé, Capitano... Wait, 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 somebody's actually marrying you? Oh, I know, right? I was amazed I could find someone up to my standards. I mean, he's not, but he's close enough, so I guess it counts. And he's bringing a friend along to sit with us at the head table, and I want you to meet him immediately so as to avoid all of the drama in the day. You understand, don't you, dear? Yes? Spectacular! Now we're going to have to talk about that man of yours. Ugh. You have to tell me everything. Or I should could just tell you nothing. Oh, but you have to. Well, I'm sitting here thinking, hmm, I need to leave here, right? I get a message, some guy complaining about how I need to stay here in this crap town. Some associate with business of mine. Orazio, my old friend! Oh, no, it's him. Capitano, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Orazio, oh, my no old grande. friend! My old friend! Yeah, right? friend. Yeah. Wonderful. You, I, it's great to see you. How have you been? I've been, uh, I've been. What are you doing in this already? I just, I just sent you a letter and it's, you're already here. It's like magic. <laughs> it's like I was already here. <laughs> Anyway, more important business. So, I am getting married, mm -hmm. and... Wait! You're getting married? Yes, I am getting married. <laughs> <laughs> wait, oh, wait, wait, wait. You wanna run that by me again? I'm getting married. Married?! <laughs> is that... Is that he's getting married! <laughs> <laughs> done? So I'm getting married. <laughs> if you don't mind, I am getting married to Victoria, and we need somebody to sit beside us at the head table. She is having her sister sit with her, and I need somebody to sit beside me. And considering you are my only friend, I would like for it to be you. I guess you know I'll, I'll come by and you know I'll, I'll sit at your your wedding and play pretend with you. And Thank, we'll all have fun. thank you, my dear friend. We are meeting with the uh, with uh, Victoria's sister at twelve, so we should probably get going so you can meet and make sure everything is good to go before the wedding. All right. All right. All right let's go. Let's go. Oh my God! Did you guys hear? Capitano and Victoria are getting married. <gasps> I have no idea how this happened, and I think magic was involved, but you know what? I don't care. There are going to be so many rich people there. It's going to be falling from the trees. It's going to be dancing bears and 57 course meals and jewelry from hanging from everyone's in there. I can make such a big scheme out of this. This is such a money-making opportunity. I'm so happy. Isn't love beautiful? Capitano! Get out there! 
there you are. Yes, dear. Oh, my conversation went wonderfully with Isabella. How did yours go? It went fantastic with Orazio, and you will be here at home just, just like you said, dear. That's what you oh, said. Oh, perfect, there. perfect. Everything's coming together. What could possibly go wrong now? Oh. Where are they? It's noon. I don't know. Don't yell at me. Oh, there oh, she is. Oh, Isabella. Victoria. So good to see you, dear. Who invited you? Who invited you? <laughs> what? Uh, you just, you disgust me. You are the most awful specimen on the face of the planet. You're just a the hog face, whiny little disgusting foot. <laughs> At least I'm not bow-legged. Oh Excuse my goodness. me. All right, all right. Hold. Goodness, what is going on here? He's a little cheater. You're a liar! I'm confused! Isabella, I need you to calmly explain to me what is going on here. Oh, what's going on here? Why don't you let him tell you, since obviously he's not going to believe me. Ah! Would you like to explain? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> well, no one even said that, that did not go at all according to plan. Capitano! Yes, dear. What are you doing? I was scotting! What are you talking about? That was horrifying! It was just two people fighting! Goodness! You went to war, you coward! How could you not handle that? And first of all, why were they fighting? I can't have this fighting! I don't know! Dear. It's supposed to be all about me! I am the one getting married! Yes, just oh. you. Just you to yourself, dear. We need to fix this immediately. You sound like you need some fixing, and I happen to be great at fixing. You need my help. Oh, do I? Yes. What do you need me to do? Do you want me to murder someone? I could. I could bribe someone. We could get the doge out of the way again. Again? <laughs> <laughs> well, whatever. The problem I have right now is that Isabella and his friend Orazio are having a fight about something very unimportant, and I need them to not be fighting. That's your problem? That's what you need my services for? I mean, I don't know if I need your services yet. Oh, you clearly need my services. But oh, yeah? for that? You could get them to not be angry at each other anymore? Do you think I don't understand the human condition? No, I don't think so at all. I can get anyone in this city to... You want falling in love or just, like, civilness? I just need civil. They can fall in love on their own time. That'll this is fine. my time. That'll be great. <laughs> All right, I will pay no more, no more than five ducats. I want 500 ducats. And yet you shall only get 50. I want 55. Oh, what? I hear 45 calling. Uh, I want 75. I hear 37. <laughs> 35. Done. <laughs> I would have done it for 50. Capital! <laughs> you useless bum! I had to pay a man so much money! Yes, dear. How hard could this be? It's not Just like they're animals. It's yes. I cannot believe the nerve of Vittoria subjecting me to that! I can't believe that Capitano would even think to put me in the same town as that! I just don't understand. Orazio seems so nice and sweet and kind of handsome she just, when we first met. She used to be so wonderful and, and sweet and caring and now she's just a disgusting pig. He is the worst thing on the planet, and I am not in love with him! I just... I... I... Just saying that I'm not in love with her hurts, it's just... It puts a bad taste in my mouth. Aww. Watch that with me. I'm just trying to be for a second. <laughs> I think you need to calm down, buddy. You calm down. Calm down. <laughs> Oh my god, they're animals! This is gonna be a little harder. I probably should have worked her up to 55 again, but it's okay. I've got a brilliant plan. It always works. My plans always work. Sure. Yeah. We'll go with that. Intermezzo time. Kind friends and companions, come join me in rhyme. 
Come lift up your voices in chorus with mine. Come drink and be merry, all grief to refrain. For we may and might never meet here again. So here's a health to the company and one to my last. Let us drink and be merry, all out of one glass. Let us drink and be merry, all grief to refrain. For we may and might never meet here again. Our ship lies at harbor. She's ready to dock. We wish you safe passage without any shock. And if ever we meet again by land or by sea, I will always remember your kindness to me. So here's a help to the company and one to my lips. Let us drink and be merry all out of one glass. Let us drink and be merry on grief to refrain.
Lazio? You've uh, got a little bit of a hair in it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really want to. I think you should. Uh, I think you should. I think you should forgive me. I should. Oh yes, you should totally forgive me. <laughs> I should. <laughs> as you prance with pointed toe. Prance! Prance! Sway those hips! Sway the hips! Sway them! Keep your chest out! This is so much harder than it looks! <laughs> <laughs> then, after you have the walk down, you must pose. You don't look at the one you want. You walk past them, you stop. 
you bend your back, you point your toe out, you fan yourself with one hand, and you lustily put it under your chin with the other. <coughs> Do you feel lusty, Isabella? I feel something. <laughs> Spectacular. And the third step is the most important step. This is how you get them to come to you. A woman must never walk up to the man. The man should have to crawl to get to her. Isabella, you are a goddess. And goddesses have a gaze. See? I'm a goddess. <laughs> you turn to the one that you seek, and you give them a smoky eye. You squint a little. You waggle the eyebrows. You look them up, and you look them down. And it just, it's, it's like magic. They just, they just flow to you. Is this working? Yes. <laughs> and that, my dear sister, is the way to instantly capture any man. They captured Capitano. Well, I mean, he's not really a man, but. So that's how you become a man. Take this advice, be responsible with it, only go after those who are 18 years or older. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh. It all makes sense now. This will come in handy at some point. After this. If you don't know my life, I have a path. Horatio? Isabella! I need you to give me a second chance. A second chance? Wait. Watch this! Oh my god! Isabella! Wow! I am a goddess! You are! And I want you to forgive me! I forgive you! So you forgive me? Yes, I forgive you. You're sure? Yes. Good. No backseat this time? No. Good. No, 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 no. Get out of here. Go. Okay. <laughs> Work on your love. My love! <laughs> <laughs> and now for stage two. <laughs> These dresses are really hard. <laughs> Again, don't want to alarm anyone, but I'm not entirely Isabella. <gasps> oh my god! god. Oh. Oh. But you are oh. so seductive! That's so attractive. Horatio, <laughs> you're back. Oh, Horatio, it's good to see you, my old friend. Hey, friend. Hey, buddy. What? Is everything okay? Have things gotten better for you? I need your help. You need my help. Victoria yeah. seems to know a lot about it, and you seem to be perfect for her, so I need to know how do you woo a woman? Oh, I've been waiting for this day to teach you, my friend. I know oh, I didn't show you all my old ways. Okay, okay. First, you have to get the walk done. You have to be proud and strong. I'm proud and I'm strong. No, you're not. Try again. I'm proud and I'm strong. Again, with Puspa! <laughs> I'm proud and I'm strong! Better! Keep it! Keep it! I like the energy! Okay, okay. Now, now you have to, you have to, like, prance in a manly fashion. No, 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 What are you doing, you dear? More manly. Sway from side to side. Own! Own any place you walk. This seems like, like the whole the world's a stage. The Hands on hips. I Good. own you. Honey, <laughs> <laughs> you wish you could. <laughs> no, no. Good, good. Now that you've mastered both the step and the walk, you need to master the oh, line. Yeah. The line? The line that catches the fish and brings them in. That makes so, a lot of sense. Let me, let me show you Capitano's favorite. Hello there. <laughs> I just messed up too. You know, you know, you, my dear, are like the center of the earth. Hot. Oh, try it. That seems flawless. Try it. Try it again. Try it. Try it for me. So, hands on hips. Sway from side to side. Owning you all. Only for our time. 
You are like the center of the earth. Hot! Perfect! Perfect! And with that technique, it is flawless. It works every time. You have to give it a shot. Oh, no, apparently all of your conquests. Go oh, well Enjoy! So I You're don't welcome! Know Isabella! Horatio! I need your forgiveness, but watch this. <laughs> I seem to not be able to tell time on my watch. Could you do it for me? <laughs> that was... Oh, you really have changed, Horacio! I've changed oh, so much. You've changed! So does this mean you love me? I forgive you! Does this mean you forgive me? I love you! Shut up! <laughs> it's like, you're no going back, this is like for solid, for realsies? Sure, it's so quick, but for now I'm gonna go tell Victoria the news. Oh, goody. My brilliant plan has worked. All you haters, all you doubters, I told you this day would come. Nicely <laughs> 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 executed. Graceful. <laughs> oh, Isabella! Horatio! <sighs> Wait, didn't I just see you? Didn't I just see you? Wait. Did we care? No! <laughs> <laughs> God, I just, I couldn't stop thinking about you. I couldn't stop thinking about you either. I mean, there's nothing that could ruin this moment. Capitano! Oh, You're so useless me. and cowardly! Stop yelling at me! I can't help it! The only way you seem to hear me is if I yell really loudly! The pull you up, I'm through! Guys, we are, hey! we are trying to have a happy moment here. I'm this sorry. is our show! <laughs> Controlling if you weren't so spineless! I have enough spine for both of us. Oh. 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 Wow, that oh. hurt me. Does he have to know not to insult my sister? This is gonna end poorly. Yeah. Count you should watch ten. over here. Count to ten. I'm One, gonna get the body back. Two, three. <laughs> Isabella, my sweet, sweet sister. I'm so happy that you had such a happy reunion with Arazio over here. Yeah. If only I had an actual man in my life. You're man oh. enough for both of us, dear. Oh! Leave this. What do you want, Virgella? I hate to interrupt, but I really don't. I need my pay. I need. There's a wedding going on, and I need to see Oh, a plan. wedding! Oh, there's a wedding going on! Oh, oh, Captain <laughs> Tano, did you know there's a wedding going wedding. on? There's a wedding! No! Wait, what? You would only get paid if there is a wedding, and there's not going to be a wedding, because for a wedding you need a man and a wife, and I don't see any men around here! Because that's how money works these days. This is a mirror. This is bad. Ugh. I should probably go calm her down. Yeah, I'll go deal with him. Bye, Horacio! Bye, Isabella! <laughs> well, that worked Aww. out. Now I've got another problem. Not only will I not get paid, because Victoria has, I don't know, some idea about how money and payment works, but she pays me, so that's how this works. Uh, the wedding's off! The wedding! My beautiful, perfect little baby of crime! Aww. Aww. But it's okay. I have another brilliant idea. Uh -oh. And it never fails. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Well, this is gonna end more late for me with questions. And second intermezzo. Yay! Yay! Apparently, I'm all they've got. <laughs> Megan, go. More than enough for two of them. Woohoo! We be soldiers three, part of the march of us all three. Lately, come forth the low.
country with never a penny of money. Here, good fellow, I'll drink to thee. Pardon him, wash tables are free. To all good fellows, wherever they be, with never a penny of money. We bleed soldiers three. Pardon them, wages are free. Lately come forth of the low country with never a penny of money.
Debut of Number Il Tatala Provisorio! 
tonight. Woo! There is the Tomato All Stars, which involves members from every single troop possible, including the Tomato Promissorio. That was not planned, just for the record. <laughs> Over in the PA tent at 9:30. Get there early if you want a good seat. Woo! They pronounced it right. All okay, bye. Yeah, that was the first. And tomorrow. Yeah. Ronya? Yeah, 10 o'clock. Ronya! 